buy right here. Hook up that uh, Walmart battery. What is up everyone? This is Kevin from h, &H Racing. Today we have a beautiful day out here in Washington and uh, we started up the G35. Right now I'm just going to clean it out and show you guys around. Um, so basically, this is a stock automatic G35 and um, it does have a rod knock and that's basically the only problem that it has. Um, I'll show you what the plan is for this car. So it does have a muffler delete and it sounds pretty nice. It's a pretty uh, deep growl and uh, I, we just yesterday put in a battery for it, um, a Walmart battery for like 50 bucks and just testing out, make sure all the windows work. This one actually rolls down super fast and um, I bought this car for $1,000 so uh, pretty good deal. Um, it does seem to have a issue with the locking mechanisms, but uh, both windows go down just fine. I haven't tried the sunroof yet. Um, this morning I did vacuum it out and I ordered some floor mats for it. Tan interior, not too bad. Um, I'm gonna get gas for later, but... Alright guys, the plan for this car is actually to do a manual conversion. That's right, you heard me correctly. This car is an automatic and we are converting this baby to manual. That's right, stick shift. And um, I did pick up some pieces here and there. I'll show you around in a bit, but the main focus of this car is to fix the raw knock. I don't know if you can guys can hear it. Yeah, you can hear it pretty loud around after 2500 RPMs. But um, this car runs and drives pretty good. I drove back from uh, or Portland, Oregon. I do live in Vancouver, so not far drive, but still it handled pretty good on the highway. But the main focus of this is to convert it to manual and also get rid, um, basically swap out the whole engine for another one. Over here, I have a manual transmission from a 2004 G35. Um, I believe it has like 140,000 miles, not too bad. Um, this isn't the CD009, which is a strong um, Z or G transmission. That's the transmission that my 350Z currently has. But um, this is just like the normal one. Um, you can see new uh, throat bearing. And here is the clutch kit, the XZD clutch kit. Um, pretty much an OEM replacement. I did get it used, but it's in really uh, good condition. Here is the clutch disc. I thought about going eBay, like an XTD, but um, because I did have good experience with eBay clutches with uh, Hondas, but for this car, I wanted to not cheap out and trying to get something uh, name brand. So here is a lightweight flywheel from XZ. See, XZ lightweight flywheel. I got all this for 200 bucks from the same guy that sold me the transmission. Really nice guy. Um, Lightweight flywheel, I think, I believe it's 19 pounds. Um, the stock one's like 30 pounds, I believe, but I also have a clutch pedal. And I got a slave cylinder somewhere laying around and some clutch lines. And I do need to order um, a master cylinder. And that should be it for the parts. There might be bits and pieces I'm missing, but for the most part, um, I got most things I need for a manual conversion. And uh, we're gonna be doing the swap on the car all the time, and it's going to be awesome. Sorry, it's super windy today, but uh, just getting some gas. G35, my girlfriend's driving. Um, we're just going to take some footage. It's our lunch break right now, so we only got like an hour, but just putting in some gas.
No, you can start it. Okay. Sheesh. How do you feel? Stressful. Dropped off my girlfriend. Let's take this thing back home. I love the sound of this. Muffler delete. You can hear the knocking a little bit at idle, but not too bad. Um, I'm gonna be checking out an engine later. It's gonna be a rev up. This is a non rev up car, but I might be putting a rev up engine in this car, so that'll be exciting. <laughs> 